Hi there, Ashley Reeve here once again. Thank you for joining me this week. This is the 12th or the week of the 12th of September, 2022. It's good to be with you guys once again. This is our economic calendar forecast. Just a couple of seconds before we go into what's to be expected for this week. Remember that uh, Quick Trade is a licensed financial service provider as well as a license over the counter derivatives provider. Myself, a registered rep working under supervision that authorizes me to offer a couple of recommendations, which you can find in the trading room as well, uh, you know, as on our live chat facility uh, on our website. Uh, but remember, the risk and reward and the execution of your trade still remains your responsibility. So as mentioned, as I always do on a weekly basis, this is our weekly snippet. You should be receiving them as a valuable client of a quick trade. You'll see the moment you've received it. You're heading at the top as always. Uh, that lets you know uh, you know who has sent it, obviously. Quick trade weekly snippet. And then obviously your trading week ahead. And to get straight into it, uh, please note, guys, inflation and interest rates have been the talk of the town uh, before we heard, uh, you know, you know, the Russian and Ukrainian war, because that was before. And now it's inflation and now it's interest rates and it will most likely dominate the market uh, trading agenda again this week. We saw a 75 basis point raise there uh, last week in the eurozone and because the U.S., uh, and the euro is so closely linked, especially when you look at your DXY and what the dollar is made up of. Uh, you you find that it's most likely that the dollar also increases by uh, 75 percent, or at least the U.S. also increases their rates by 75 basis points. It's three quarter of a percent. You should also notice, uh, you know, you know, tracking what has happened so far or thus far. Uh, that the U.S. is running close to a four-decade high, and this is putting uh, pressure on policy, you know, makers to uh, continue to uh, increase those rates. And what's very important for you guys also to know is that when you are looking at the dollar, to correlate that very, very accurately and closely with some of the other securities that we, you know that we do offer at Quick Trade, you find uh, you know in addition to uh, what could happen with those uh, interest rates, we have the CPI release on Tuesday morning. Uh, the producer price index inflation reading is scheduled to be released on Wednesday, while retail sales and industrial production reports are due on Thursday. Uh, also, for you guys to remember. Um, that the queen, uh, the, the queen, or at least the passing of the queen, uh, and you know, her funeral will be scheduled for Monday, the 19th of September. The UK stock market will be closed on that day. There is further information, or there is more information about that in the morning that takes after the funeral. And we're not 100% sure how it will impact the market yet, but what we do know is that politics, economics, and sociological factors definitely do play a major key in the movement of. Price. So please uh, check out all your new sites, uh, you know, to just be updated with what is happening uh, in that or, you know, in that side of the world or on that side of the world. And then obviously for us here at Quick Trade, we uh, do give you a couple of forecasts. We're looking at Brent uh, and, and WTI. We are also looking at gold as well as the NASDAQ 100 as, and the Dow Jones and S&P 500. Now, remember, with the dollar being a little bit weak now, especially this morning, really pushing down uh, these uh, opportunities here, gold uh, and Brent specifically here with commodities might have a nice jump up. And so maybe just go through your technicals, join us in the trading room uh, to get more information or more detail on what we mean here. And then your uh, FX, we are looking at a uh, long for GBP AUD, uh, but that's subjective only to, you know, the levels should it break. And I do see, uh, you know, that level of 1.71232, uh, you know, to be broken first before we push up to 1.73921. Great risk and reward. Uh, make sure that you know what phase the market is in. Uh, we had a bit of a consolidation in the specific pair last week, but join our trading room to get more detailed information. Also for other opportunities on a daily basis, don't forget the trading room runs uh, twice a day, one in the morning and then one in the afternoon as a recap. I'll be back again uh, later on in the week uh, to possibly give you an update if there's anything that's out of the ordinary. Uh, I'll probably check in a little bit earlier, but for now, uh, please uh, make sure that your risk and reward adds up and then make sure your technical analysis is sound 
and I'll join you again later on in the week. This is Ashley Reeve for the 12th of September 2022 uh, economic calendar forecast. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.